Hi, I'm Ben Katz, a naturalist with the Forest Preserve District. Today on Nature in a Nutshell, we're going to explore the wonderful world of insects with our species spotlight on the firefly. Fireflies are a very special member of the insect group. Before we get into them specifically, let's review what an insect is. Insects all have three body parts, a head, thorax, and abdomen. All insects have six legs, one, two, three, four, five, six. Insects have antenna and compound eyes. Our firefly has a very specially adapted abdomen that allows it to produce light, whereas most insects primarily communicate with their antenna and chemo, or you could say smell-like senses. The firefly uses its sense of sight to communicate with a series of flashes, which we'll get more into in a little bit. Despite their names, fireflies or lightning bugs are neither flies nor true bugs. They belong to the order Coleoptera, which is actually the beetle order. Beetles are the most numerous insects uh, with 300,000 named species in the world. Uh, that's out of 900,000 named species of insects. So you can see fireflies are not alone, but they are very special. In the world, there are 2,000 species of fireflies, and we have just under 200 right here in North America. Today. Both male and female fireflies can flash, although many female species are flightless. Fireflies can flash in many colors, including orange, yellow, and green. Males fly around at dusk, flashing their pattern repeatedly until they are answered by a stationary female waiting on the ground or perched on a plant. The male will then fly over to his mate. Firefly larvae are called glowworms. They overwinter underground or underneath bark. They are predaceous with sickle-like jaws and more interestingly, they glow as well as their adult counterparts. Fireflies flash for a couple reasons, to find a mate or to lure in prey. Each firefly has a special pattern of flashes and may also fly in a special pattern so that it's very distinct from any other species of firefly. A unique example of how a firefly uses its flash pattern is the female Photurus. She actually mimics the flashing of a different species of firefly to draw him in and then she eats him. In the light organ of fireflies, two chemicals are combined to create a light that is 99% efficient. That means almost nothing is wasted as heat. And this is a very important thing for scientific research. The enzyme that produces light in fireflies has been used by scientists to mark tumors and to help track blood disorders in humans. Scientists have also used fireflies as inspiration for other cool light technologies. Light sticks can be used in difficult situations, such as by deep sea divers or by miners where traditional lighting could cause an explosion. Not all fireflies are nocturnal, and even those that are can be found hiding in bushes where they rest during the day. Environmental temperature affects how often fireflies flash and the flash's brightness. As temperature increases, so does the frequency of flash patterns and their intensity. Fireflies are just one example of the many organisms that call Kane County Forest Preserves their home. Thanks for joining me today. We hope to see you soon.